Though Edge web fonts have over 500 fonts available, there may be times that you want a font that isn't available, and that's when you can use a custom font. So what we're gonna do now is go over to our font area. We're gonna add a web font, and instead of grabbing one of the Edge web fonts, we're gonna click on Custom. So what we're looking for is the title or the font fallback list, as well as the embed code. So what I'm gonna do now is go over to Google Fonts, and you can simply go google.com slash fonts. There's no need to log in or anything. You can just download any of these fonts for free. And I'm going to go ahead and grab this font here called Girl Next Door, and I'm gonna click this little button for quick use. And if we look right here, it's actually gonna tell us how long this type of font will take to load on the page. And it looks like a pretty fast load speed. I'm gonna scroll down, and what I'm looking for is the embed code here. So I'm gonna click on JavaScript, and I'll select all of this code, and let's copy, Command-C, Control-C on PC. And I'll go over to Edge, and I'm gonna paste this in the embed code area. And let's go back. And now we need the title. So I'm just gonna grab Girl Next Door. Let's copy this, place this here, and we'll say Add Font. So just gonna double click and check and see what this looks like. Everything looks pretty good. We'll save. And let's select our text, go over to our font area, and we'll click on the new font. And that's how you would add in a custom font. So between the Edge web fonts and the ability to add custom fonts, you're not limited to just the fonts listed in the font menu.